Well, I finally put the TV into that hole. Remember the TV's too big for the hole that was in it. Uh -huh. And uh, I built it in such a way that if I push it over here, the center of the screen is in the center of the hole from partition to outside of, well right now it's center, center of the hole. I can slide it over here and it hits a stop, won't go anywhere. Yeah. Now it's the center between that cabinet and the outside of the cabinet. <clears throat> and I got all these goodies here uh -huh. that uh, can slide out for the disc, but you can still it's far back enough that this, and I accomplished the equal distance, top to bottom, bottom to top, not the bottom of this, but the bottom of the original hole. The original hole's down here, so I had to build it up and out. <coughs> and I've got this guy up here. We found some uh, home movies and uh, I sat the other day, and I sat in here and I got as close as I could, but the light behind me was on, and in the middle of the picture was this little golden thing. Oh, boy. But the uh, movies goes back to when the, the three oldest grandkids were young, and I found some neat paper out in the sheds. And I thought it'd be map paper. Yeah. It's about this size. Uh -huh. The edges are all kind of burnt like looking and look like so I made treasure maps. And I don't know why the parents it seemed like they had a hard time of you know, kids couldn't follow the map they or they could have, but they made the they made the moms and dads read them. But anyway, I'm going to shut this off now and so the next video, camera's going to be here, I'm going to take a shot of an old home movie. So I thought that would be kind of neat, so we'll see how it turns out.